Hey everybody, Crypto Mentor 99 How you doing? It is Friday, September the 6th. Doing some videos. I've got an afternoon off. Mrs. Crypto Mentor 99 or 99 and I are going to go downtown, have a late lunch, do some shopping. And I've learned many years ago if mama ain't happy, nobody's happy. I got to keep mama happy. Um, yeah, 39 years married as of uh, early August this year. So, um, yeah, I love my life because I love my wife. Anyhow, let's talk about Apple. Like Apple, Apple, like Apple, Apple. Um, this is an article from the Currency Analytics. Full disclosure for those new people, I'm a writer, contributor, and telegram advisor. I forgot about that uh, for the currency analytics. Also, obviously, do YouTube videos for them. Um, why do I have to? No. Why? Because I want to. I get to. And for those of you that don't know currency analytics, quick commercial. Um, there's a lot of FUD meaning fake news in the crypto space when it comes to financing you don't want to make investments based on fake news mrs crypto mentor 99 hi hon how you doing hey, hey. okay yeah i'm doing a quick video that i'm recording okay. i'll see you when you get home okay i'm on my way all right love you bye love you. Bye. bye real life in real time anyhow she's coming home um, where was I at? I forgot. Oh, investing. Um, I've lost a little bit in 2017 based on a inaccurate news article. That's my fault. That's this guy's fault. This little guy. This little crypto investor guy. But one of the things that I like about Sydney Ifregan and the currency analytics, it's to their mission statement is to eradicate fake news and give you real news in the cryptocurrency space. That's important when you're investing. End of commercial. Back to Apple. So Apple is approaching the cryptocurrency market with an open mind. At least they're not against it. Not that we need Apple to jump on board to help with mass adoption, but it would help. Um, this article was written by Dan Sada from the Currency Analytics. I'll put the link in the description box below. But according to Apple, cryptocurrency has lots of potential and it's very likely to become part of our payment system in the future. Oh, you know that. You got that right. It doesn't take Apple to figure that out. Jennifer Bailey, vice president of Apple Pay, stated, We're watching cryptocurrency. Oh, I'll bet you are. She further stated, We think it's interesting. Oh, I bet you do. We think it has interesting long-term potential. You know it does. Just come out and say it. It's good to see that the tech giant is approaching cryptocurrency with an open mind. Uh, Bailey stated, Interesting long-term potential. That's what they're looking at, thus leaving the doors open for Apple to dabble in crypto itself, or they might choose to slam the door on it in the future. Who knows? But I remember in late 2016, early 2017, the few articles that I read from Main Street Media outlets, um, no one really liked cryptocurrency. It wasn't until I found like the currency analytics. Coindesk, Cointelegraph, and some of the other news outlets. Um, but my favorite is the currency analytics. I'm not going to lie. So anyhow, take a look at this link below. But yeah, Apple, um, this is not the first video I've done on Apple, but Apple is kind of throwing their hat in the ring going, yeah, we're watching cryptos. Yeah, we think it's interesting. Yeah, we think it has interesting long-term potential. That means that they're taking a hard look at it, and they have been taking a hard look at it. They're just acting like, yeah, we're somewhat interested. No, they're real interested. Do I know that for a fact? No, but I've read thousands and thousands of articles since um, 2016, 
2017 when I got in the crypto space. Uh, oh, I forgot in August, I had August 14th or August 17th, I had my two year anniversary doing YouTube videos. Anyhow, Crypto Mentor 99, got a date with the Mrs. Mrs. Crypto Mentor 99 this afternoon of 39 years of marriage. Anyhow, love her to death, love you guys. Gals, thanks for being part of my crypto family. You may get tired of me saying that, but I mean it. Thanks for your comments, and uh, yeah, love y'all. See you later. Bye-bye.